I don't know. My shit. Shit getting a little long. You know what I'm saying? Look, you want some funny shit? I be tying my shit in like a scarf when it's like winter time, and like everybody be looking at me like, what the fuck? Like this nigga don't even need to buy a scarf because that shit be. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's good on. I be warm as a motherfucker. <laughs> Are you ready? You got shit written down for me. For everyone. That's what's up. Is it the same <laughs> shit? You say the same shit to everybody? Well, no. <laughs> no. I mean, I'm just asking. What's your name? Ricky. And <laughs> how old are you? I'll be 28 on Monday, actually. How do you feel about that? I feel old. I'll be looking at all these little niggas I be tatting. They all be telling me like they was born in 2000 and shit. I'll be like... <laughs> I'm like, oh, hell no, nah, bro. I'm getting old as shit. They don't listen to half the music I listen to. And you know, the shit that we listen to be cranking. They don't even fuck with that. <laughs> Every, everything, everything that they listen to is running your mama house with a 30 or something stupid. You know what I'm saying? Sex, drugs, money. In New York, too. Turn the fuck up. Yeah. Okay. So, who are you on a soul level? Who am I on a soul level? I'm a fucking stoner, man. <laughs> <laughs> I am a stoner to the T. Like everybody who knows me knows it. You know this. Like <laughs> you know me for years. Like, but I'm also an artist, so I'm a stoner artist. I don't fucking know. What is your art? Like, what do you? What do you? What explain I mean, for people you know, who don't know? Well, for the people who don't know me, I do tattoos. I think I'm pretty fucking good. You are. You Some are. Some people may think otherwise. Fuck you. But, um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'll be doing the tattoos. You know, I draw sometimes on my little iPad or whatever, but only if I'm about to tat it because I'm not drawing for no reason. I don't got time to do that shit. That shit is boring. <laughs> so, tattoos is it? Bas your artistry? Yeah, tattoos is basically it. Do you I mean, still you, play the piano? I was say, yeah, you know, I play the piano too. I make beats. Lately, I've been making songs. I don't know why, because I'm not trying to be a rapper. You've been singing. Uh, a little bit. <laughs> a little, <laughs> little auto tune in there, you know what I'm saying? But I've been making songs lately. I don't know why, because I'm not trying to be a rapper. I don't even want to post the shit, like, for downloadable content. <laughs> like, honestly, I just make the songs and ride out to that shit when I'm by myself. Like, so you make music for you. Yeah, I get, That's tired, I get tired of hearing the same shit that everybody's talking about. Even though when I be making my shit, I end up talking about the same shit that they be talking about. But <laughs> you be running up in somebody's I, I, house in the 32? No, nah, I ain't doing that. But if you run up on me, you might get hit with that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, yeah, I be, I be zoning out to my own shit. I don't got time to listen to everybody else. Unless you shit crack. <laughs> 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 okay, so I'm about to ask you these questions, and I'm gonna ask kind of slow because we know that what? you're stoned. That don't mean shit, nigga. No, shit. listen, it's a lot. That okay? don't mean. All right, Are you yeah, ready? I'm gonna respect that. There are three categories. Okay. And I want you to pick which one is most important to you and which is least important to you. Okay. All right. The first category is love, sex, and relationships. The next category is society, culture, and politics. And the third category is spirituality and religion. So, out of those, which means the most, which means the least? A lot of people are going to hate me for saying this shit, but uh, I'm not really religious. Like, I don't believe... You're in not me. the first one that said that. Oh, all right, well then cool. Fuck it. I don't believe in Jesus. So, religion is probably the least that I really care about. Okay. Because I'm not reading nobody's Bible that's been altered a million times. You're not going to make me believe that this guy here did whatever the fuck he wanted to do <laughs> for me when at the end of the day I'm going to die. There's people out here, great people, <laughs> like real shit, this is real shit. There's great people out here who died, like Nipsey Hussle, prime example, great motherfucker. No disrespect when I say that, but great dude and died for dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? So you think there's but no... There's other people out here raping little girls and playing with little kids' buttholes and shit. And they out here walking around like shit is cool. Like, nah. So, you can't, I don't believe in that shit because at the end of the day, everybody say praise Jesus. They pray on Jesus and want some good shit to happen. They want blessings and all this. But at the end of the day, the good die before the fucked up people do. So, who is there to really believe? I believe in science. <laughs> okay. But. So, what's the most important to you? So, you're not spiritual at all? I mean. 
Like you don't think that there's something bigger than us out here? Oh no, of course. Like I definitely okay. believe I definitely believe in a higher power, but I don't believe in, in Christianity, Christianity religion. Okay. or anything else like Jehovah Witnesses, none of that shit. Like well, I, mean, most people I, don't believe. I just don't care. Like yeah, because I feel like when I die, I'm just gonna die. Mm. I do believe in reincarnation to a point, to an extent. But um, yeah, I, when I die, I'm just gonna die, and life is gonna go on. Heaven and hell to me is just a dream that never ends. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If you did some fucked up shit, you gonna have a fucked up dream for the rest of your damn eternity in the afterlife. <laughs> 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 like, it's like real shit. You gonna burn forever in that dream. Like it's just you gonna have sleep paralysis and some more shit in that motherfucker. <laughs> Nah, but if you did some good shit, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. Like, <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, okay, which one means the most to you? I don't really care to have sex. So, I don't, I don't know. Why? But, I mean, of course I love sex, but I said love. But that shit sounds stupid. <laughs> of course <laughs> I love. <laughs> Take two. It's like, nah. But, um, yeah, I mean, of course I love sex, but it's not important to me. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, girls go crazy. And I don't got time for it. Like, I don't have time for it. Like, okay. No disrespect to you, that you're my man. It's, it's yeah. You're a female, but nah. Like, this shit is stressful. I'd rather be having sex with somebody I'm in love with. You know what I'm saying? And so far. So I'm, is love at the top for you? Uh. <laughs> regardless. I, I don't of really care to be in love. Like, I just care about myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, to be honest. I mean, if I love you, I love you. It's going to show, but right. at the end of the day, am I going to put you before me? Absolutely not. I, I don't <laughs> care. I, I don't care what the fuck the situation is. Unless, <laughs> unless, unless we got kids or some shit, like we married. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't know. Like, I don't know. If, you, if you're my homie and I fuck with you hard and shit, I'll take a bullet for you, but... And we just started talking, and <laughs> for example, we just started talking like two months ago, and we at a restaurant or some shit. Somebody coming at y'all, I'm gone. Like <laughs> you better, you better keep the fuck up, y'all, because I'm out of here. Like <laughs> I'm gonna call you when you get out of that motherfucker, see if you're alright. But I'm not running back in there. Like that's dead. So it's like nah, like I'm not putting myself. I'm not putting nobody else before me. So what is important to you? Because the last one is society, culture, and politics. And I can't really I see you saying like, I don't oh. give a fuck about no politics. I, I don't <laughs> fuck with Donald Trump at all. So fuck the politics. I feel like my vote is just one out of a billion. Like, whatever. You know what I'm saying? So I don't really care about the politics. I care about the culture because I feel like society is changing like shit. It's pretty fucked up. The music is taking over. And it's draining these little kids' brains. Like completely all they care about is fucking and walking around with guns like you should see half the little niggas that i do tattoos on these niggas i feel sorry for any girl that date half of them like wow. except for the ones that i'm cool with because a lot of them they cool but <laughs> <laughs> i tell a lot of little niggas too but like i'll just be looking at them sometimes and listen to what they be talking about and i'll be like bro i don't i just can't relate like they just don't give a fuck like they literally take music and run with that shit like yeah they i literally see these little niggas walking around with 30s like it ain't nothing and i'd be like bruh y'all niggas need to be safe out here because we ain't my like, virginia you know people out here be tripping like nah <laughs> they will lock your ass up and just throw away the fucking key on your ass like i'm not fucking around in virginia <laughs> at all <laughs> most black people aren't all right they ain't even got nothing to do with black people like i know some white people that ain't fucking with virginia Virginia is just a fucked up state, but <laughs> unfortunately I live there, so. All right, look, I'm going to get you to draw. I'm going to get you to pick a color that represents your mood right now. My mood? Yes. And I, I want. I think you know what color I'm about to pull out. That's fine. <laughs> and a color that represents your life, or you can do multiple, and I'm going to get you to draw for the rest of the interview. That represents my life. I don't know. Honestly. We're gonna pick gray. Gray for your life? Yeah, because my life ain't where I want it to be. <laughs> so I still. I'm, your, that's, I mean, I'm in a gray area of my life right now. Okay. So maybe. Are there any other colors? Uh, 
Nah, I mean, we'll do teal. I like teal. Okay, okay, that's pretty. Yeah, that's all right. All right, here. All right, you gonna color for the rest of the time? Draw, oh, whatever. Yeah. What am I drawing? Whatever you want, and I'm gonna ask you questions. Okay, ready? All right. Okay, what makes you the most upset? <laughs> what makes me the most upset? Well, motherfuckers ask me a million questions. <laughs> like, oh my god, like, like me, like, bro, don't be. Nah, like if I got a girlfriend, she's gonna hate me. The moment she asks me three questions in like ten minutes, we have a problem. Like, <laughs> why do you have to ask me a question to break down another question, to break down another question, just to get to your conclusion of an answer? I don't understand it. Like, there's no need for it. If I tell you something, it should just be that. You know what I'm saying? Why? <laughs> why, why, why do you gotta sit here? And, this is not no motherfucking pop quiz. Like, nah. And then it's like sometimes when you're talking to people and they ask you a million questions. You feel like you're obligated to answer them sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So then I'm sitting here like, bruh, I don't know. Like, I just told you. And it's like, you want me to sit here and think of other shit to say just to tell you the same shit that I told you the first time. It's like, nah, I, I can't do it. Okay. So what makes you the most excited? Oh, shit. I got it. <laughs> you good. You good. You good. Okay. But uh, what makes me the most excited? Yes. What excites you most? Money and weed. Money and weed. Money and weed. Simple as that. You, like, you know me. I'm a boring ass nigga. Like, <laughs> I don't be doing shit. Like, I might go to the bar. <laughs> I might go to the club if it's an occasion or some shit. I really don't know what to draw here, too. But, uh, Whatever. Draw what's on your mind right now. Whatever. I can't, man. I'm cut. But, um, yeah. What the fuck was I saying? <laughs> 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 you threw me off, yeah. Like, shit. But, um, I'm you a boring ass nigga. So, it's like, all I do is tattoo. And smoke weed. Like, I might wash my car like two times a day or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> Other than that, it's like, I'll be chilling. Like, if you, people fuck with me just because of that. Like, they know that I'm a chill ass nigga and I don't care to do nothing. No hot boy shit. Like, I'm not the type of nigga that's about to chill with a bunch of niggas and do nothing. Like, we're not about to sit around in a green box and smoke weed. We're not about to get drunk and look at each other. Like, Right. Nah. So it's like I don't even have the niggas that I fuck with. I don't even talk to them. Just, <laughs> and it's like vice versa. Like we don't even talk to each other unless it's like some serious shit to link up for. Right. Like somebody getting married. Oh, okay. Somebody That's birthday. Nice. Other than that, I don't care what the fuck you're doing through the week. Don't even hit me unless it's a motherfucking event going on. Like I'm in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Trying shit. <to>, like. <laughs> all right. All right. What are you? Afraid of? What are you most afraid of? See, you ask me questions when you draw. I can't do it. Yes, you can. I believe in you. What am I afraid of? I'm afraid that if I have kids, one, my kid died before me, and two, that I would fail to be the best dad I could be. Other than that, I don't give a fuck about nothing. I'm not scared of shit. Why do you think you'd fail as a father? Oh, trust me, I don't think I'm going to. I'm just oh, saying. Okay. If, just scared, it was, like, if, if, it if it was to happen. Because, happen, yeah. you know, girls be tripping. Like, it goes back to the sex. Girls be tripping. Like, I'm not about to have no girl or no baby mother. And you sitting here trying to use the child as an animal on me. You know what mm. I mean? Like, or none of that. So it's like, yeah. if I got to sit here and not be a part of my kid's life because you want to be an asshole, then that's fucked up. And I'm pissed off for the rest of my days. <laughs> like, right, yeah. I feel you. Are you self conscious about anything? Uh, like, like, kind of insecure about some shit about myself. <laughs> yeah. I don't like my ass. <laughs> I swear to God. Wait, I swear to God. Like, I'm self conscious about my ass. And <laughs> I feel like a lot of men can relate to this shit. Like, if I'm, I look. If I'm fucking or something. Oh my God. I'm not letting you look at my ass. Like I'm not. I'm gonna do everything I can and still be in the zone to like make you not look at my ass. Like if I get up and I gotta go get you something, I might fuck around, and walk backwards to the door. Like swear to God, I cannot. I'm gonna walk backwards. Like I cannot. And if we in the shower, this like I'm about to sit here, hurry up and do this, and get the fuck out because. <laughs> Eventually, I'm going to have to turn around. And it's like, you're not about to sit here and get a full glimpse of my ass. Like, <laughs> like, like how we be looking at y'all ass and be like, damn, you're not about to do that to me. 
That's dead. Why? The only you time something in your head that makes you self conscious. I just got a, I just got a stupid flat ass, and it just. <laughs> I, I'm saying like I don't, I don't want no fat ass or nothing, but it's just like what the fuck. I, I was in my ass one day. I was like, "What the fuck, nigga? Like, this shit ugly as fuck." Like, nah. Like, I I do not like the way my ass looks. So. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't. This is amazing. Okay. I'm just saying, man. Wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is crazy. Oh, okay. Man. You got me weak over here. Right? <laughs> What don't you want to tell people but know you should share because it'll help someone else? What don't I want to tell people? Yeah, but you know you should because it'll help someone. Don't do drugs. Even though I smoke weed. And that's your soul. I, I, encourage, <laughs> you to, I encourage you to not do it because the moment that you fall in love with it, you're going to have hella bills that's going to be fucked up because of your habit of weed. <laughs> 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 Real shit. You can be like, damn, do I want to buy this KD or do I want to go pay my phone bill? Then you sit back and really make decisions like, shit, fuck it, I got Wi Fi. I'm going to thug it out for like <laughs> two weeks until I get this money again and then you go buy weed. So it's like, don't smoke weed. If you don't smoke weed and you're young, don't do it. Oh because even though weed is great, it has a lot of benefits, but, but you know. <laughs> That's just some stupid shit, though. Like, I wasn't even serious with that. But I really don't know, man. I don't really care about shit. I tell you, like, I don't care about shit but myself. I don't care about the politics, what's going on. <laughs> I don't care about nothing but the money. Like, seriously. Okay. So, what do you feel will restore connection in our generation? If you did care, what would you say? If I did care... All right, let me look. Let's rewind. Like, I care to an extent. Okay, I don't care. Like, I lost somebody to suicide, so it's like, I definitely care about how people feel when it comes to shit like, shit like that. Like, let niggas know how you feel because my man's, he will walk around every day cracking jokes, but deep down inside, he thinking about please. killing himself. You know what I'm saying? Bridge will close in fifteen minutes. Shut up. All copiers we and know. computers <laughs> will automatically shut down five minutes before closing. We're not all DIY will also close five minutes before nine o'clock. Please be sure you have saved your work and completed your print jobs. Oh Thank you. How much do you think they pay her to say that shit? Um, nothing. Seven dollars an hour. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like. I don't know, man. If you if you feeling some type of way, like real shit that's making you think suicidal thoughts, you need to let that shit out. And you need to talk to somebody. Because not only is you killing yourself, like not only are you like fucking up how everybody else feels, you fucking up how everybody's life turns out. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas with kids, like they kid might kill themselves. Now this person is depressed forever because they kid and killed themselves over this stupid ass little nigga at school taking his lunch all day. You know what I'm saying? Like it just be dumb shit. So I don't know, man. I just think everybody should stay in their own lane, focus on themselves, and speak their mind when need to be spoken. Like <laughs> real shit. Like I don't know. I'm, just, I'm high. Sorry. So. <laughs> um. Let's see. Do you have any weird habits? I do. I I probably shouldn't even tell you because like people gonna look at me on this job and be like, this nigga is a creep. <laughs> Not even a creep, but like a weirdo. But like, I can't help but to pick a scab. Like, is that weird? I think a lot of people do that. Like, I don't personally I, do that, but I, I swear, if you're my girlfriend and you got a scab, you better get the fuck away from me. You're gonna try to pick I'll somebody else. I will oh pick that motherfucker. Ouch! I swear to God, like if it's not if it's like big as shit, like you fell off a dirt bike and you scared the whole fucking. <laughs> now if it was if it was me and I did that shit, this whole motherfucking shit is getting peeled the fuck off. Oh my god! And it's it's so weird. Like I don't, no, I don't. Like that. It's like I know one day it's just gonna end up scarring up. I'm gonna get tattooed over that shit. It's like I just can't help but to peel that shit. Like I don't know what it is. It's so annoying. Like I don't know if it's like because I be scratching this shit and then I end up going across that joint or some shit and then it be like what the fuck. Now I'm irritated. <laughs> like because I've already peeled a little piece off. Now it's gonna be sitting here dangling on my arm. Like nah, I gotta get you off here. So okay. 
So I'm going to ask you some questions out of this book called 3000 Questions About Me. I'm only going to ask you about five of them because it's like a lightning round. And these I haven't seen either. Interesting. Okay. <clears throat> okay. First one. Are you reliable? Do you consider yourself a reliable person? Uh, it depends. What does it depend on? <laughs> <laughs> How hard I fuck with you. <laughs> like, okay. Or if... The money's involved, you know what I'm saying? But if it's just some boring shit, like, not boring shit, but, like, I don't know. It, it just depends. I ain't anybody getting detail. It depends. Okay. Um, let's see. What is your favorite joke? My favorite joke? Yeah. Or what's the funniest thing you've seen or what's really funny to you right now? What's the last thing that made you laugh really hard if you don't know a joke? Because, honestly, a lot of people don't even tell jokes anymore. Uh, you ever seen that dude? It's not even like a joke or nothing. He just be dancing on Instagram. But I think his name is like Mufasa. He Does he always, have the words? He always has the green shirt and the orange shorts. I'm not and he's like skinny as shit. He be in the car. And then he'll just hop out the car and just start fucking him up, yo. No, I didn't. I watch, watch this nigga video, dog. I don't know his name. I'm going to have to find this shit right now. I don't know what his name is, but he funny as shit. Every time I watch his new videos, <laughs> that shit be getting me so weak, bro. Like... <laughs> Cause then I just be saying like, how the fuck do you got the energy to even dance like this? Like, <laughs> I be smacked like shit. It's like I'm not even about to sit here and try to lift my leg up. These niggas be doing all that. The only dance that I be doing is like the whoa. I fuck with that shit. Tough as shit. You I should need, do it. Do I, it right now. I, I need the tunes, man. Like, okay, play a song. I'm not gonna do that. You're not gonna embarrass me like this a lot. What if you get I'm not I'm I'm look, doing it? I'm not. I'm not. Whoa. I be fucking that shit up. Okay. But I'm, so, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. Like, nah, I'm, not, I'm not going to do it. I don't even know what that dance is. You know, see, that's how they finesse you. Because then you want to sit here and act like you don't know what it is. No, I really and don't then, know what it and is. And I got to show you and demonstrate. And then you can be like, oh, yeah, I seen that all over Instagram. Like, <laughs> you won't get me, buddy. <laughs> You're not okay, I'll Google it later. I'll Google it later. You are so stupid. What is your favorite fruit? <laughs> Uh, I got a lot. I like mangoes. I like strawberries. I like cantaloupes. I like blackberries, even though they get stuck in my teeth. I like a lot of shit. I don't eat, like, I try to eat dragon fruit, but that shit is so bland and boring. Like, yeah. how dare you look so colorful and fruity looking, right. and then you taste like this fucking piece of paper. Like, no. I, I don't like those, but... All that other shit, like the normal shit, I eat all that shit. I love bananas, but I'm starting to think I'm allergic to them. Yeah. Because they make my stomach hurt every time I eat that shit. Like, I don't know what it is. Mm -hmm. But I love that. I'm going to still eat that shit until I die or something. Have you ever ridden a mechanical bull? Or would you? I probably wouldn't because I'm going to be dizzy as fuck on that job. Like, I can't. <laughs> And then I'm skinny as hell. I might fly off that bitch. Like, nah. I'm like, that girl might throw me across the room or some shit. Like, okay. Like, and last question, because I know she's about to come on this intercom soon and say something. What do you have to say to the world? Um, Be yourself. Don't worry about what another motherfucker doing because half the time you be wrong. <laughs> so <laughs> don't make assumptions. Stay in your life. I don't know. Be the best person you can be. But I don't know. Bet. Leave me alone. <laughs> that's another. That's that's what I got to the word. Leave me the fuck alone. <laughs> if, if I don't bother you, don't bother me. Cause I be in my own world, doing my <laughs> own shit. If you ain't talking about no money. You ain't trying none. Leave me the fuck alone. Do you know that song? Like, leave me. I yeah. love that fucking song. Like, <laughs> oh, I love that song. Girl. That's like. That what song do you hate right now? Oh, shit, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a fucking lot. Um, the one I really fucking hate. I hate, like, all Lil Pump songs. Mm -hmm. Not all, though, because some of them Jones be getting me hyped. Like, I'm not even going to say it. Gonna say it. Like, <laughs> some of them Jones, like, Derek, what, D-Rose? That shit gets me turned the fuck up. But I used to like that old Town Road shit just because oh. it was different. But now yeah. I'm hearing it on the radio every fucking day and his verse is like this fucking long mm. so i'm like bro like i don't care about the wranglers on your booty no more like i don't care about none of that shit but i respect him for what he's doing 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? I respect it. Like, I ain't no hater, but I'm starting to hate the song. Like, let's see what you drew. It's so boring. I'm. T- <laughs> I don't know what to draw. I'm just like, you can't put me on the spot like this. And just, like, <laughs> what is you? Just I'm not even getting paid for this. I ain't even getting paid for this drawing. So it's like, let me put a little blue line right here. The <laughs> Hold you on. like let me sign it. Uh, my signature might be tighter than this picture. Okay, like, cool. If I can remember that, my <laughs> okay. All right, cool. Now show the word. Oh, you really going? Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Ush. You gotta. Yeah. That's how I'm feeling right now. And the woman <laughs> got me in here answering questions <laughs> the, that you hate. <laughs> You're lucky you're my homie because <laughs> I would definitely be like, so about that check, I'm gonna need that before we leave. Like $20 or something. Like, put it on my gas tank or something. You know what I'm saying? I need that. But, you know, I don't love you, man. Thank you for doing this. Do you have other people's pictures in here? I kind of yeah, want to be nosy. Yeah, know. go ahead. You can look there. Are you putting all this on the video that you're about to post? Or you already stopped it? No, it's still going. Oh shit, we off we off the scene. <laughs> <laughs> we off the scene. We are. I, I'm look. Oh. Fuck. Hey, it's, it's, uh, I like this moon shit. You know, it's pretty boring. <laughs> but yeah. I'm gonna get that dead. I think I got to tie this down. Here. <laughs> here you are. This is Ricky in the flesh. Ricky be tatting, actually. <laughs> <coughs> oh, you made it. <laughs> <laughs>